Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last month in February, I posted a video that Microsoft had announced that in March, Edge, the Microsoft Edge web browser, will get an update that will add the Adobe Acrobat PDF engine inside the browser's built-in PDF reader and viewer. And according to Microsoft, that would give Windows 10 and Windows 11 Edge users more PDF features. Now, today we are on the 2nd of March in my region. And just to let you know that in Edge Canary, which is a preview version of the browser, indeed Microsoft has kept their word and we now see Adobe Acrobat features starting to be made available in the PDF reader and viewer uh, in Edge Canary. Now here in the bottom right, and I don't know if you can actually see this properly in the video, but in the bottom right we've got the little Adobe Acrobat icon. And if I hover my mouse over that, it says powered by Adobe Acrobat. So exactly what Microsoft said they were going to do. Adobe Acrobat PDF technology is now available um, in the PDF reader and viewer in Edge Canary, which is a preview version. And if we head to the top right, um, we have Try Acrobat. And if we click on that, we have advertisements. So do more with your PDFs, unlock these tools and more in the Adobe Acrobat extension for Microsoft Edge. Now this is obviously for premium Adobe Acrobat users. So you can start different trials. Edit text and images, convert PDF, combine files. You can start the, the seven-day free trial or not now. And if you have an Acrobat subscription, you can sign in. So um, this seems to be only for subscription paid customers who are, who are signed up and have an Adobe subscription. So if you are just like me or a regular home user, uh, it doesn't seem that you will be getting those extra PDF features as originally announced unless you sign up and have an Adobe Acrobat subscriptions. But just wanted to let you know, it's not available yet in the stable version. And this uh, Powered by Adobe Acrobat is only appearing on my um, Edge Canary browser on my Windows 10 device and not my Windows 11. So basically this is a controlled rollout which will happen progressively into the month of March. And try Adobe Acrobat now available directly in the PDF reader now in the Edge browser, now in preview, and there's a good chance though that this will be rolling out to the stable version in the not too distant future. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.